All right, if you're not familiar with the Intel card, these are uh, very inexpensive cards, and this one has a four gig uh, memory, and it doesn't require any power. It uses the motherboard power, so you don't have to worry about extra additional cables. This is perfect for these mini PCs. Uh, they do make different versions. They are higher versions. Now, the only reason I got this one is because it, it works for the PCIe connection. is smaller than the other one, and if you guys can see, there's not that much space on these things, all right? So you got to make sure that you have enough space for the out. So we're going to open it up right now so you guys can see what I'm talking about. All right, let's take a look at the inside of the Acti OptiPlex right here. You can install a PCI card, all right, uh, E uh, connection. It, this one has a one uh, two terabyte kind of hard drive right now. Uh, you could additional memory. All right, so we're going to reduce the size of the footprint on this system because it's so small, the desktop, that we're going to introduce the smaller connection, if you guys can see that. But don't forget this cap, too, at the end. If you want, you can, it's an optional. You don't have to have it there. You know, but just for security purposes, I would. Hey, man. Marry the video card. Make sure everything's in there properly lined up then push it down and then lock it in place i can hear the card running on this one all right so just to be clear those that bought this card you're going to need to install the latest update on the actual driver of the video card all right all right we just opened up sketchup if you guys could see that and sketchup is a low-end um, model um creator and and look at this, it, it runs really good because the video card is well working very well with it. Performance, it's, it's running. Now, I got the minimum installation in here on the actual memory, right? I, I don't have, uh, I have 32 gigs of memory and I have a solid state drive. I don't even have an M.2 in here and it's running really good. So if you want to increase just a little bit more performance, you could upgrade those two things. But overall, this machine is not capable of playing every single game inexpensive you can find it pretty much anywhere i hope you guys enjoy the video